not your fault, then you don't deserve All the bad and the hurt I know you tried so hard Ooh, I know you've done your part It's not fair You did your time How much longer will you suffer in this life? But don't give up Just hold on tight It'll be alright All your life you've tried To be a good man inside Did everything that you thought you should Didn't seem to do you any good because I really didn't have time because I'm on my way to church and I'm already kind of like behind. I wanted to go grab a coffee and then be at church because my church is kind of, it's not like in the middle of nowhere, but the church that I like to go to is off another freeway. <laughs> um, but yeah, I decided to get up and go to church today. I wanted to make it an every Sunday thing again because they are finally open inside. Like you can go in instead of having outdoor church and just watching like the live church. Um, so I got ready, it's 8.30 in the morning. And I'm super excited. It's my first time with baby K going to church. And um, yeah, I'm super excited. I'm meeting my friend Kelly there and we're gonna be there for an hour. The service starts at nine. And then um, me and my mom, we're gonna do a little bit of baby shopping. And then I was gonna go to my friends and then we're going to go to dinner. So yeah, I just wanted to say good morning. I miss vlogging. I literally have just been doing a bunch of nothing. Um, all I do is sleep and eat and work. Um, I don't go on maternity leave until June 10th, but I do move into my apartment May 15th. So that's super exciting. I cannot wait to move. I'm like super excited to like set up all the baby stuff. Um, and yeah, so I just wanted to say good morning. This is the makeup look I ended up going with. Just super simple. I honestly just threw this outfit on. I had no idea what to wear. Today it's like overcast and it's 50 out. So I was like, okay, let me dress kind of like cool. Not sure if church is gonna be hot, but I can definitely take off my jacket. Um, but I didn't know what to wear. I wanted to wear a dress today, but it's not hot or sunny. So we picked the old, but the goody um, olive green jacket with a flannel and some leggings and my shoes that look like Birkenstocks. They're just like the Target brand. Um, but yeah, I packed pretty much my entire room besides my vanity, so I don't really have that many clothes. And I've just been working, so I only left out like all my work clothes, not like going out clothes. So whenever I like want to go do something, I just go buy a new shirt at Target. And I just wear my maternity leggings and sweats all the time. So yeah, I hope everyone has a great weekend. Um, I'm excited to be off today. I'm not off till Thursday again. So yeah, I will talk to you guys soon. Well, you guys can see me. I feel like I look swollen or like out of breath or something, but this kimono is like tight on my back. I don't know. Um, anyways, so I just got ready. Um, today's Friday the 16th, I think. I don't even know what today is. I think it is the 16th, honestly. 14th, well, I'm just rushing the week. My camera's dying and I was gonna vlog the whole day. 
we love that what's up guys welcome back to the vlog i look a mess my tan is crazy and i'm in a nursing bra like what are we doing here i've been vlogged in a while um i've just been busy growing this human in my belly and working and preparing for him and this week is a big week for me so i wanted to pull out the camera and vlog and try to get this to be the start of all the vlogs doing my baby shower prepping for him going on maternity leave up until labor like i wanted to start filming now um so yeah i just did my makeup um I have to run a couple of errands, so I wanted to bring you guys with me. I need to go to Hobby Lobby, Michael's Car Wash, and Donation um, today. And then tomorrow, um, I have a doctor's appointment today at 4 also, but it's over the phone. And then tomorrow I have my second prenatal massage, so I'm super excited about that. Um, I'm quite swollen in my legs and feet, and my lower back and feet have just been hurting so bad. Um, and Friday, I'm doing my brows, my toes, <laughs> and then Saturday, I'm doing my lashes, and um, what else are we doing on Saturday? My lashes, and I'm picking up the um, cookies. Friday, we're doing the, we're picking up the chair, the chairs and the tables for the shower, um, and then yeah, so I'm just doing all that. Sunday is my baby shower. Um, so I just want to make sure I get everything done from that. I'm still waiting on a couple of packages to come in from Amazon. I feel like I literally ordered almost everything on Amazon except for like a couple things. Um, and the things I want to look for in store are plates, napkins. Or no, I have napkins. Plates, cups, and then like these little excuse me like these little wooden coasters but I kind of want to see if they have like a little bit bigger than like a normal like cup coaster so that I can see about putting um what's it called putting the mason jars for the centerpiece centerpieces on the table on those and then putting like little ultrasound pictures of the baby um baby k i have his name picked out but i do not want to announce it until he's born but if you guys know me personally or you've been around me you know his name but it starts with a k that's the hint i will give you guys here on youtube but if you know me you know his name um but yeah so i want to do ultrasound pictures of him um around the tables but I wanted to get like little wooden coasters. I also need to get some burlap table runners, like four, two more tablecloths, or actually three. And um, I also need to get obviously the eucalyptus and the baby's breath for the centerpieces, like Sunday morning. Um, but lots of preparation to do for that big day. I'm super excited. Last weekend, I went to my friend Mylis's baby shower. She's also pregnant, and we're five days apart, um, or technically like seven. But I went to her shower and it was just super fun and I haven't been to a baby shower since August when I was at Mariah's baby shower in New York. So I'm super excited. It just doesn't feel real that he's going to be here in seven weeks or less. Um, I'm going to be 33 weeks on Sunday and this pregnancy like literally flew by. Um, I've loved every single minute of it. I'm getting super anxious to meet him and seeing how cute he is and all his little features and um, just being his mom and teaching him about life and introducing to him to all the people who love him. And um, this has been like the best time of my life. Honestly, I love being pregnant. It's super fun feeling him move and kick and grow in my belly and just knowing that I've protected him in the protected him in my belly for eight months now um but I'm ready to bring him into the world <laughs> I'm ready to put him in all the stuff that I've got him he's got so many outfits so much things in my room <laughs> um to do in here I still have a lot to do mainly pack hospital bag diaper bag and then film those videos I want to film like what's in my hospital bag and stuff like that um but today is my 32 week appointment it's just over the phone checking up on him but I have been swelling a lot in my feet my hands not necessarily in my face that bad I don't think I look that bad I don't know what I'm doing with my hair I kind of just like left these pieces down and I was gonna like curl them and I just do a hair my hair in a bun but um yeah, I'm excited to be back in front of the camera. I've like literally missed it so much and I thought I'd start the vlog today with running errands. Um, but I'm doing all the fun pedicure, lashes, all that stuff this weekend before the shower. Um, I need to get these brows threaded. They don't look bad when I fill them in, but when I don't fill them in, you can tell like 
all this hair going right here um but i don't really do my makeup i only do my makeup on sundays for church and i wanted to do my makeup today because i was wide awake today and i just feel like i like being put together you know so i hope everyone is doing well um I can't wait to show you guys all this stuff. Update, I am not moving. Um, that is something a lot of people have been asking me. Um, have I moved into my apartment? No, I actually am blessed to take over my parents' house. So the baby gets a room. I get a master bedroom. And this bedroom is going to be my filming room. And then the other one is going to be a guest bedroom. So you guys will have a lot of vlogs coming. Home renovations, all that fun stuff. Um, I'm not moving. They let me stay here. And I'm super excited to show you guys how I transformed this house and I'm excited to like decorate and stuff like that. But I'm out of breath. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and get dressed. Um, I'm gonna go run my errands and I will catch up with you guys. Hopefully we find everything that we need. Um, but I will see you guys in the car. All right, so I went to Michael's. I didn't vlog in there because I was kind of like all over the place looking for the burlap and the little wood things for the mason jars, which I found. Um, I found the little wood things for the table, but I only bought two of them and I needed four, but they're like $10 a piece. So I'm going to see how they look. I just don't know how I can get the ultrasound pictures to like sit up on them. Um, but the mason jars are going to go on this and this is what they look like. They're so cute because the cake is actually going to be on a really big one of these. So I'm glad I found those little ones. And then I also got... Their twine and burlap should honestly be in the same section of the store, but it wasn't. Um, I got some of the ribbon burlap for around the mason jars. Hopefully this is enough. It says that it's five yards, so I'm literally just going to tie ribbon on around four mason jars. And then I got the um, twine to do the belly measurement thing where they measure your belly and tell you, like, or they try and see if, like, their ribbon is as big as, as, big as my belly or whatever. Um, so, Yeah. It was fun. I'm just so tired already from just not taking a nap and then going over there and doing all that. Um, and then I got some candy in the store too. But I went and got a car wash and dropped some donations off already so my car is nice and clean um, on the outside. I didn't get it detailed this time. But um, yeah, baby is um, going crazy in my belly and I have to pee really bad. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys what I got. yesterday and today it's like super sunny and then it's like cloudy but it's like the sun is still out as you can see in the background but it's like what the heck is going on like anyways um i almost 
almost his baby's name. He is like been doing balling up type motions where like his legs will like push out super hard on one side and it like hurts my butt. <laughs> I'm just like, oh, what are we doing in there? But anyways, um, yeah, so I'm getting ready to be at her house and I will show you guys what we do and then the pictures. Okay, so I am at, I almost said Skylar because that's her fiance. I'm at Nicole and Skylar's house and we're doing chalkboards. She finished one and I love it. Now we're doing, we're doing, she's doing them because I'm not that good at it. Um, but we're doing the donut bar one. So we're literally gonna copy like how the letters work look on that. And then we printed this out because we're doing succulents as gifts. Um, so this is please take a baby succulent and watch it grow. So we're gonna put this in a frame on the table. So now we just need to do all this for the food. And then she made an oh baby sign or boy oh boy sign and these are like the little circles that go like below it. But we're working on these and then that's the donut wall one and then that's the baby shower one. I'll show you guys in a minute but things are coming together. Once we're done with the signs we're gonna go to take a couple pictures.